Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm very excited today because I want to share with you my hand-painted tag. So if you remember, just a few days ago, I uploaded how I removed the heat stamp from my tag. And you can see that it still leaves some mark and some indentation on the tag. So I got that tag. So I got that tag um, painted. And the painter is actually um the former louis vuitton in-house painter so i'm very very excited to share um the step by step um he will show you how he did it and here we go like kaputra hi i'm like kaputra and today i'm going to paint the louis vuitton tag that lauren just sent me earlier today but um before that i want to introduce myself uh but how do we start my name is Leka Putra and I am an artisan painter or some may call it as luxury artisanal painter. What I do is basically I paint on luxury items that you have and from all kinds of fabric, uh, from canvas, from leather and, and from some other fabrics. How do I start? Okay, I have been drawing since I was a little kid, since I could barely write a single letter. But interestingly, I started my career not related to art. I, went, I was a uh, store manager for a fashion retail store because at that time I, I was still not confident about my skill in art and I was not confident that art could pay my bills so yeah I was working as a store manager but I was still doing art related jobs as a side job but after a while I gained connections I, I have a solid portfolio and I decided to be a full-time artist After a few months, after just a few months, decided to be a full-time artist, Louis Vuitton is actually the ME uh, on my social media, asked me if I am interested to be their in-house painter. To be honest, at that time, I didn't know what in-house painter was, so I was just came to their office and they told me what the in-house painter is, and then I was, of course, I was interested and I did some tasks and I sent them my portfolios and I got accepted as Indonesia's first in-house painter for Louis Vuitton Indonesia. So yeah, that was an incredible experience. From Louis Vuitton, I learned a lot about the uh, technique of, of painting on luxury items. But after a while, like a year and a half-ish, I resigned because at that time I was also studying, uh, I'm taking my master degree. I took a business master degree, uh, so I have to focus on that for a certain period of time, so I resigned in, I guess, in early 2020. But um, now I have already finished my master study. And I have graduated and I am starting my own business and I am going back working for myself now. So yeah, I guess that's about me. <laughs> you can check out my Instagram at Painted by Leka Putra. Um, yeah, I guess let's start painting now. Before I start the painting process, I usually make the designs, a few designs usually that the client can choose. And these are the initial designs that I show to Lauren. After a few feedbacks and discussions we had by text, Lauren decided to go with this design, which I personally very excited about because I think this is nicer than my initial designs. Okay, so let's start the painting process. The first process is to create a white layers. 
This white layer is important not only to make the colors pop, but also to create enough layers so the paint will be solid and not easily worn out. After a few layers of white paint, I usually wait until it's dry and then I start to sketch the white layers with pencil. You don't have to go super detailed with the sketch, just enough to create the right proportion. After I make enough sketches, then I start painting. This is exciting. I usually started with bigger area and then gradually go into more details area. I think we have finished the bigger area and now we are going to the more interesting part that is detailing. What I like about detailing is that the details really make the painting really come to life. For the smaller object, I usually hold my breath so I can create a very thin lines. Okay, I think it's done. But wait, it's not totally done until we furnish or coat the final result. I usually wait for like three to five hours minimum or it's better if you wait until like one night for the paint to really dry until you apply the coat. Coating or varnish is important to make the color stays and usually it could create some effects that we want. And it's done. What do you guys think? I'm pretty happy with the result and I'm hoping that Lauren is also happy with the result. And I'm going to find out and I'm going to send this to her. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you also Lauren for having me in your YouTube channel. It's been fun. So this is it guys. Okay. So this is a bag. How cute is that? As you can see from the step by step how um, he did this one. He is very, very detailed and it came with this. Got my name and let's open it together. Ah, it say it like this. Thank you for painting your precious item, Leka Putra. And a note over here. And it said, Dear Lorraine, item number, and thank you for your interest for me to paint on your tech and feature me in your YouTube channel. Um, wishing and family a happy, fun, and rich life. Regards, Leka Putra. So this is the card that came with it. And this is the Vivian. So, as you know from Leka's video, at first he came out with a two design because I, uh, I told him I wanted something pink and I want um, um, the Noe bag to be featured with this Vivienne. Um, that's because, let me show you the bag. Um, this pack actually came with this bag. So, yep, this is the multicolored Noe, and this is actually the bag that came with it. So, how cute is that? So you have the multicolored Noe with the with Vivian in here. So I'm going to put it here. I will look like this. So pretty. I'm. 
Thank you so much, Leka, for your amazing work. I'm sure there are lots of painters out there, but I want someone with um, experience in a luxury. So um, there is no one that I think of better than Leka. So I am very, very, very happy with the result and I highly recommend you guys if you want um, to paint your item. Um, I will link his Instagram, Instagram down below so you can check check his Instagram okay thank you so much guys for watching what do you think about today's video if you like it please give a thumbs up and also um, please subscribe to my channel thank you so much guys bye